Hey guys, it's Amanda. Welcome back to my channel. I have another grocery haul to share with you. I went to two stores. I went to ShopRite and Walmart and I spent over $300. So it's gonna be a long one. So let's just hop right into it. Overview of everything I got. I just combined a Walmart and ShopRite thing, so I hope that's okay. I'll try to remember what I got from where, but it's whatever. Um, I'll just start over here with the produce stuff. Um, most of the produce did come from Walmart because it is cheaper, and personally, I love Walmart's produce. Never had an issue. At least in New Jersey, Walmart has good produce. So I got some of the mini sweet peppers. I got some bananas and some romaine. I got some cucumbers, um, some peaches, and some bell peppers. I did get some of the broccoli florets that are already cut up and ready to go in this bag. Um, I just I like buying it that way. And I did get some cherries. I think these actually were from Shoprite. They were on sale. And these were this was from Shoprite. There was a coupon. Um, they are the Dole Bountiful Salads. I love the Dole pre-made uh, salads, but these are like a new one. They're the Bountiful ones. Um, I ordered like a ranch one, but they were out, so they gave me these lentil cucumber ones. Um, I don't know, so I just took this. It says there's fresh chopped green lettuce, iceberg lettuce, radishes, cabbage, um, a Bountiful blend of marinated green, black, and red lentils. I don't know, so I got two of those. There's coupons, so they end up being really cheap. And then I grabbed three plums. And also from ShopRite, I got a whole case of blueberries. These were $7.99, and then there was a dollar off coupon, so they were $6.99 for a whole case of blueberries. Um, I think I mentioned before, I am like 15 minutes from the blueberry capital of the world, so blueberries are pretty inexpensive at this time of year, so I was able to grab these. I will freeze some for smoothies. We eat a lot of blueberries just fresh, so I'll have a couple out in the fridge, and then I'm also going to make some blueberry muffins and bread and stuff like that, so that'll go, I'll be able to freeze those as well too. So I wanted to grab this whole case because that was a really good deal. And I'm going to be picking these up like every single week now. Um, I love having these on hand. I don't mind paying extra for the convenience. Um, these Walmart apple slices. I think you can get these at BJ's too um, for more. Um, you get more of them for less money. But I don't go there all the time. Uh, it's just the pre-sliced apples. And I love having these little bags in the fridge. I can just grab and give to Emma. She loves snacking on them. Um, the kids can just reach in there and grab them and eat apples pre-sliced. And they don't go brown. And, you know, kids won't eat apples if they go brown. So love having these. I think they're like a three-something, four or five five count, which is kind of pricey. But, again, it's really great to have on hand. I also am trying this um, new salsa. It's the fresh cilantro salsa. I got this at Walmart. I couldn't find any like fresh pico salsa, um, like with the fresh, you know, chopped onions and tomatoes. I couldn't find that at ShopRite or Walmart. So I grabbed this one. It's a pretty big container and it's pretty inexpensive. It says it was never heated or anything like that and it looks pretty good. So we're gonna give this a try. These Santa Cruz juices were on sale at ShopRite. I think they were four for like $3. Um, so I never tried them before, so since they were on sale and had a coupon, I wanted to give them a try. I grabbed, they're all the organic ones too. So, so this one is the pomegranate. And I got raspberry lemonade. I think I have two raspberry lemonade. And then this one is mango passion fruit. I also got a rotisserie chicken. This was actually $4.99 with the coupon. And then the pickles were on sale. I think they were three for three or something like that. So I got the stackers. And then I got the purely pickles one. Um, I just want to give these a try, see if we like them. So it's like the no artificial stuff in it ones. And then I just got the regular ones. Back here I needed some apple cider vinegar. And the kids are really loving the taco bowls that I had prepped for them using these. So there's a coupon that I could use at ShopRite, so I wanted to pick these up, again, using that coupon. And I did grab some roasted red pepper hummus, and I did get some strawberries. These are from Walmart. I got some butter, and then some applewood smoked bacon. I never tried the Jimmy Dean bacon, so um, this is on sale at ShopRite, so I want to give that a try. I did get the Hebrew, Hebrew National Hot Dogs. I needed some queso, so I got the queso blanco dip. Um, this is on sale. And I needed some red enchilada sauce. 
and some parsley. Um, this wishbone dressing was three for three, and I got the ranch. I don't know why the ranch is smaller. That's annoying. Um, I got the Robusto Italian, and then I got some Caesar. And then back there, I got some Heinz ketchup. That was on sale as well. I did get some 2% milk, and then I got some of the Four C Season breadcrumbs. I got some heavy cream and some sour cream. From Walmart, I got the pepperoni. I just like Walmart's pepperoni better. I don't know why. Um, I did get some American cheese, and then I got the ShopRite brand turkey. This was on sale, I think, for um, $5.99 a pound. And then I got some sliced provolone cheese, and then I got a block of the Philadelphia cream cheese. These were just so cute. I like these. They were on sale, the um, Pepper Jack cracker slices, so they're just already sliced for you. Um, that's so easy and convenient. So I got two of the Pepper Jack kind. And then I got some sliced Swiss cheese, and I got two different cheese sticks. I got the Colby Jack and then mozzarella. And then I got some crescent rolls. And I also got some mozzarella cheese, some Monterey Jack cheese, some sharp cheddar. Well, I get two sharp cheddars. I got some elbow macaronis and some minute white rice. And then from Walmart, I did get the goldfish, the big pack of the goldfish. Um, I always grab the Chobani gimmies usually from BJ's because they're on sale, but um, we usually get the berry flavor um, at BJ's. That's all they usually have, and I really like these. They have like less sugar than the um, Go-Gurt ones. So I really like these, especially for the baby, and they're like smaller too. So then at ShopRite they had this creamy orange flavor, so it's, I guess it's like an orange creamsicle flavor, so I think that'll be fun to try. I think the big kids will like these too. And they also had these for the Chobani gimmies, and we've never tried these before, so these are like the Chobani like flips they have for adults, um, but the kid version. So this one is the Poppin' Cotton Candy one, and this one is the S'mores one, and this one is Birthday Cake, and this one is Chocolate Chunk cookie dunk so I guess it's just like yogurt and then it has like little pieces of like something so this one has pie crust pieces birthday cake flavored rice clusters and rainbow sprinkles this one has rice crisp waffle cone pieces and popped greens this one is milk chocolate chips graham cracker and marshmallow flavored rice clusters and cookie dough flavored crisp with milk chocolate chips. So there's nothing artificial and protein packed. So I thought these are really cute. Again, just for like something fun and a fun snack, not like breakfast or anything like that. And I also saw these, they have like so much new yogurt. It's a, like so much fun. And these are the Gogurt Dunkers. It just like brought me back to Dunkaroos, which I don't, do they even have those anymore? I don't think so. I don't think I will let my kids have them anyway because they're just like pure junk. <laughs> but these are like little cookies, but then you dip them in yogurt. Um, so that's like a healthier snack. The yogurt has some protein in it. Um, and I just thought these were fun. We've never tried them before, so they are new. So we want to give those a try. We, there was a bunch of different kinds, but we got the chocolate and vanilla yogurt. I did need some fajita seasoning. We're trying the McCormick kind this time. I can't ever get a fajita seasoning down right. I don't like any of the kinds that I make or put together, and I don't like any of the kind that I buy at the store. So I don't know. I need to go to like a restaurant and just buy their seasoning because... I can't ever get one right. I did get a 12 count of eggs. These were actually free. There was a coupon for a free 12 count of eggs if you spent 25 bucks. So I definitely grabbed those. Um, I did get some Purdue chicken patties. I have a ton of these in my freezer, but these were on sale and they had a coupon. So they ended up being really cheap and you can't get the kind that I got at Shepherd right at BJ. So I did get the spicy one. So I got two of the spicy ones. These are really, really good. And then I got two of the popcorn chicken ones. Then at Walmart, I did get the beefsteak um, rye bread. I did order the Walmart kind, but they were out, so they gave me the um, name brand for the same price. And I did get the Pepperidge Farm strawberry swirl bread. It looks amazing. And I did get the Pepperidge Farm um, sesame topped hamburger buns just to have for um, burgers. I have a bunch of frozen like hamburgers just in case you want to have for like lunch or something. Put these in the freezer. And then these were super on sale at um, ShopRite. I think they were like $1.99 for like this huge pack. This is like a two pack. And I'm gonna make some like frozen breakfast sandwiches with those. And I got these a bagel crisp. I think if you, yeah, I think if you bought two of these, you got the hummus for free. 
So I did get the two of those. I wanted the garlic ones, they were out. They just gave me plain, which is fine. So I got the two of those and then I got that for free. So that's awesome. And you can go to ShopRite without getting rolls. So I got a, um, I think I got eight of them, eight rolls to have with sandwiches and stuff like that. They're just amazing and like just super, uh, just amazing. And the cereal was like, crazy good deals. I think these ended up being like a dollar a piece with the sales and the coupons. So I ended up, I ended up getting the Special K. Um, I got the fruit and yogurt one. And then this is like the protein um, cinnamon, cinnamon brown sugar crunch. I never tried that one. And then I got cinnamon toast crunch, which is my kids like favorite. And then I also got Reese's Puffs too. I might do this deal again just to stock up for like um, back to school time because cereal really doesn't go bad for a while. Um, and these are like a dollar a piece, so that's pretty good. All right, I think that was everything on the table. Then I have like a ton of meat back here because again, they were like having really good deals to stock up. I just got some ground beef that was regular price. And the sausage ended up being like $1.77 a pound, I feel like. So I grabbed, grabbed a bunch of that. Um, I can divvy it up and freeze it. And then I needed a roast for a dinner, so that was regular price. And then the thinly sliced chicken breast was like an amazing sale. I think it ended up being like half price of what it is at Walmart, and Walmart already is really cheap. And I think I bought $20 worth of this, so I'll be able to take that in the freezer and have it for a while. I really like, I usually don't ever find meat on sale. Like, I'm not lucky like that. I'm not good at stocking up on meat and stuff. I know a lot of people are. Um, so I found this and I was like, yes, I'm going to stock up on it and get it in my freezer and I'll have meat for a while. So that was a really good deal. And I got a lot of like ice cream and stuff. So these were um, a coupon I had. Uh, it's the Ben and Jerry's chocolate chip cookie dough chunks. It is actual like snackable cookie dough. So they had a peanut butter one and then they just had regular chocolate chip cookie dough. Um, so I grabbed the regular chocolate chip cookie dough and it's a pretty small, pretty small bag. And it was like $4.99, but there was a dollar off coupon and I want to give it a try because it looks amazing. Um, this Baskin Robbins ice cream was free because I bought two waffles. So I got the strawberry waffles and the home style waffles, which we go through waffles like crazy. So I, I needed those anyway. And then I got the free ice cream. So we got the mint chocolate chip and I got the Good Humor original vanilla chocolate ice cream bars. There's 12 of them in there. They were on sale. And these are also on sale. We've never tried these. Um, they're the organic whole fruits um, frozen juice bars. Um, I got the apple cherry and apple blueberry ones. I got these mainly for the baby. Uh, we do like the frozen like um, juice popsicle things from BJ's that I got a really good deal for. Um, but they're like running low already. So I wanted to grab these. These are really good for like her to have. And when the kids are having these, you can't tell her no. And she's going to make a mess with those. And these are just better to have. And I needed some whipped cream. And then I got just some regular sausage to heat up with the dinner. And then I got these McCain seasoned crinkle fries. I've never tried these ones. And for drinks and stuff, the Gatorade, I think, oh, I forget it was on sale. Three for 11 maybe, when originally it's like three for 15, so that was a really good price. So I got the blue, the white. I got one blue and then two of the white ones. The water, I got three of those. If you bought three Nestle Pure Life waters, you got this guy for free. It's a Nestle Splash Wild Berry. I've never tried this, but the kids will probably like it. And I've been buying juice boxes, so they'll definitely be all over that. And then the bubbly water um, was four for eight, which I think it's originally like four for 12, so that was a pretty good deal too. I got the lime, um, I think I got a peach, an orange, and then a blackberry. So I don't think I've ever tried bubbly water. Um, I know they have really awesome flavors, but what my Walmart doesn't have a lot of good bubbly flavors. I think they have like cherry, which sounds gross to me. So um, the only time I can get good bubbly flavors is if I go to ShopRite, which is rare. So I wanted to get a bunch of different flavors to try. You know, we love different sparkling waters. So I grabbed those. And some non-food stuff I got the, uh, finally, if you guys have been watching my grocery hauls, I finally found the shampoo of this L-Vive line. It's for the oily roots and dry ends, which is basically my hair in the summer. Um, I get sweaty, like oily roots, but then my ends are still dry and 
need some love down the ends. And I've been always being able to get the conditioner at Walmart, but never been able to find the shampoo. And ShopRite had it, and there was a coupon, so I got that. And then I just got more of the Blonde Ever Pure shampoo um, because there was a coupon, and it ended up being like half price that it is at Walmart. So I wanted to pick that up just to like have on hand. Um, and then I did get my um, favorite plates that I always get. It's the um, just the 170 plates from Great Value. I think this is like five bucks. This will last us like a month, and that should be everything for my grocery haul. All right, guys, and that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you love grocery hauls, please give this one a big thumbs up because that always helps me out. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.